Hello and welcome to the overview of our latest software called Omni. So this is the login page of Omni. So in here you have to enter your login credentials. And once you have logged in, you'll be able to see this page. So Omni comes with multiple funnel options. It includes Done For You, which is loaded with products, guaranteed approval, and pre-formatted pages. So this Done For You funnels offer a perfect solution which will enable users to generate income while building a valuable list at the same time. So it's 100% done for you affiliate funnels. It has built-in traffic systems and no need for you to have domains, hosting, any codings or design. So in here, upper right side, you have the profile, your access, and log out here. And then here, you'll be able to see your dashboard, the settings, statistics, so trainings and tutorials, and if you have purchased instant traffic. On the right side, you also see here training and support, which then you can click for tutorials available and do reach out to support desk. So first, let's try to create a campaign. Click on create campaign. And then you have to enter a campaign name. And then you'll be asked to choose if you are to create a landing page or a thank you page. So let's try first to create the landing page. And then from here, you'll be able to see landing page templates available for use. So you have here at least 15 or 16 landing page templates available. So you have free guide, e-commerce, uh, ebook. Um, super basic squeeze page, lead gen, coupon page, course funnels, so a scheduling page, fitness, webinar. So it depends on what type of landing page you would want. So let's try to create first an e-commerce landing page. So you can choose to view the landing page and this one to select. So as you can notice here, it's fully customizable. So you can upload your own image for your logo. You can also choose an image coming from Pixabay. So you can select file from here. So maximum image width is about 1,200 pixels. So let's just leave it for now as it is. And in here, you can actually edit the contents on the landing page so it's fully customizable so let's say get 30 off on apply the changes so sign up to get coupon code all right so in here you will see that the website visitor would just need to enter their name and email so this one the image is also customizable you can upload your own image all right so on the disclaimer part you can edit it from here So you can also customize here on the last page and the footnote so in here so aside from customizing this one so for the autoresponder setting if you want to use the API so you can see that later on the settings tab or if you want to copy and paste here your script code from your autoresponder you can just click on here and then apply changes for the tracking code you can paste here Google Analytics or FB retargeting code then for the SEO options so you can enter your page title your meta descriptions and meta keywords so take note for SEO it's for the ranking on the search engines so for the thank you page you can tick 
here for successful submission and failed submission. So if you want to customize here if they are unable to submit their email. And for successful submission, you can choose to redirect users to the website or display a message. So in here, you can just put your redirect URL and choose if you want them to be redirected on the same window or a new window. For the form controls, so you can type in here or change, let's say sign up. So let's try to save it. So you'll see that it has been saved. So click on publish option or generate ads. When you click on publish option, you will see your link. So copy link. So here is what your website URL for the landing page would look like. So once they have signed up here, and then you have customized your redirect URL, they'll be able to go to your website directly. So going back, you'll be able to see here on the landing page publishing options, you also have a WordPress plugin. You also have the HTML for your landing page that you can download. Alright, so let's click this done. I can click here on the upper right, generate ads. So you can enter your keyword. So keywords. When you click generate ads on the upper right portion, so you'll be able to see here three different ad sets. So it would have the title, it would have a description, ad description, and it would also include your web page URL. And then you can select from here. So it will generate some keywords automatically that you can just customize when you're ready to run ads and Bing ads or MS ads or Microsoft ads. So once you click also the keywords, you can just simply copy them and then paste it to your Microsoft ads. And if you want, you can also have the option here to download all ads in Excel so that you'll be able to see them easily. Going back to our dashboard, you'll be able to see the campaign that you have created here. So we can see that the status is active as we have already published this campaign. So here are the things that you can do. So on the first one, we have here the edit campaign. You have the generated ads. So we have clicked that. We can see also the statistics. On the statistics part, you'll be able to see views, average time, unique visitors, leads, and referral. So so you can select the campaign from here if you have created several campaigns already. And then we have here the clone campaign, delete campaign, preview campaign, and share. So you have here an option to share it on Facebook. You also have here Twitter, Pinterest, and LinkedIn. Now let's try to create another campaign. So create and then let's say we want to create a thank you page. So we can select this one, edit your logo, again from Pixabay and then enter keyword. So let's say you want to use this image. With the background, you can also choose to browse and select. So you can click here to edit the text for 
thank you for signing up and then check offers so similarly for the thank you page you can edit the following form controls all right seo options tracking code for the autoresponder setting styling so you can change the background from here so let's try to save this one and then click on publish option so if you want a simple thank you page to be generated you can just copy this one let's try to go back to our dashboard so here you can edit the campaign again if you want to generate ads for the thank you page and then if you want to see statistics clone again delete preview and to share the campaign so basically it's how you can create campaign and customize them so let's go to the settings tab so in the settings tab you will notice that you have here different autoresponders available for integration so this autoresponders would provide you correct settings for smooth and efficient omni functionality so we have the aweber mailchimp get response i contact active campaign and go to webinar for the privacy policy in terms of service content you can select which campaign and then edit the privacy policy data from here so it's select which campaign and then edit it from here do not forget to click save so again on the statistics tab you can select your campaign and then you'll be able to see here how many views average time they are visiting the website unique visitors leads and referral so basically that's how omni would function so it would save you time and effort from backbreaking work and you wouldn't need to have any hosting or domains so thanks and see you on our next videos for omni